Hey guys, today I'll make a video on how to install Splexus ROM build tree. 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 Yeah, tree. Okay, so first what you have to do is get CWM recovery. Yeah, get CWM recovery. And you have to get the ROM file, of course, and JAPS. All will be in the link in the description. So let's get going. Okay, first question is uh, when do I have to wipe data factory reset and wipe cache and wipe delta cache? This tree you have to wipe when you're coming from a different ROM. So now I'm already on Super Nexus, but I'm built too. So it's kind of like an upgrade. Uh, if it's an upgrade, you don't have to wipe. So basically, what I have to do since I'm on an upgrade, just install zip, choose zip, and wherever you put it, I put it in my folder called Super Nexus. And it's called Super Nexus Build Tree. Go ahead and install it. It's gonna take quite a while, um, but I'm gonna leave it like that so you will see it move. I don't want any accusations or anything like that. So, yeah. This is Ash Tree here. It's, I, can't, I can't zoom on. I can't focus on it, sorry. There. Ash Tree. I don't know why I bring it in. Anyway, now it's out of camera. Sorry about that. Okay, it's installing. Okay, it just finished. <laughs> okay, that was great timing for me. Anyways, you want to go next into flashing your jabs. Let me focus. Um, Jeps. Jeps um, is very fast flash. Um, yes, it's flashing. Don't think it spoiled or anything. It's flashing. Um, Okay, so um, it's finished, the flashing of G-Apps, that's pretty much it for the flashing video on how to flash slash install Super Nexus build tree, now I'm gonna go ahead and reboot to show you everything's working. In the next video, I'll show you how to flash CR kernel on the Samsung Galaxy Ash 3. It's just, let it boot. It takes quite a while to be exact. Uh, just let it go. That do this thing. Well, I'll be back after it finishes proving. Yeah. Um, I'm not gonna pause the video. So yeah. Um, is optimizing apps. It just finished the first stage of booting, so give it some time. This may take quite a while. You may want to skip the video, although until this is done, because this I have a lot of apps. Today's lighting is quite nice. I have the street lighting from my window, so it's kind of bright on camera, even though it's kind of dark if you look at it in person. In the meantime, let's play our ash tree. Okay. 
Wait, let me check if that's anything personal first. Okay, that's not impersonal. Is my free? Yeah, I'm probably gonna do a video on it soon. I am not doing any yet because I'm currently waiting for the jelly bean to come out. So, yeah, that's the reason why. It's the opposite of mine. I'll come back after it finishes. Sorry about that. The tripod got knocked. Oh, no. Okay, I'm still here. Um, yeah, I can admit it takes quite a while upgrading. However, this ROM is supposed to be quite good. Sorry for the background noise, it's my sister and my mother. Whatever. But yeah, it's finally done. Optimizing apps, starting apps, updating, and finishing its boot. So let's get going. And that's it. Super Nexus RAM is finished booting. Okay, let me show you. To prove to you. There. Okay, wait. I'll zoom it all the way in for you. To make sure you can see that. Here, this is. Okay, sorry about that. That, that. Okay, anyway. So, that's the end of my video on how to flash Super Nexus Build 3. In my next video, I'll tell you how to flash see your kernel. So look forward to that. Um, I'll look forward to another video. The video. So remember to give thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. My thumb's getting cut. Um, give me thumbs up. Give me subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to me, and comment below. This video has been kind of long, so I apologize about that. Thank you for watching and goodbye.